Hello viewers, hope you're doing well. Today in this video, I'm going to call send Firebase push notification in the React project of the admin. So let's get started. So first of all, I'm going to install the Axios. So the command we have npm install Axios. Let's hit enter. As you can see, Axis installed successfully. After this, I'm going to install React Toastify. As you can see, React Toastify installed successfully. Let's go to the React project of the user. From the index.js, I'm going to copy this import that we have, React Toastify. Let's go back to the React project of the admin. Let me add inside the index.js. Now after this, I'm going to add here the try and the catch block. The catch block will catch an exception in case of API failing. So we have to catch here the error. And here I'm going to add the console.error to print the error message. After the catch block, I'm going to add here the finally block where we have to set the loading false. Let me remove this console. And inside the try block, I'm going to create an object with the name and data where we have to set the title. Second, I'm going to set here body. At the last, I'm going to set here the FCM token. After this, I'm going to call the exist and the mapping we have post. Inside the quotes, I'm going to add here the URL of the endpoint. So let's navigate to the postman. Let me copy this URL. Let me add inside the quotes. After this, we have to pass here the that object where we have a title body and the FCM token. Let me add here the await and I'm going to save the response of the API into this object and that is the result. After this, I'm going to add here the console.log to print the result into the console. After getting the result, I'm going to add here the condition where we have to check if the result dot status ripple is equals to 200. Then we have to show here the post notification with the caption notification sent successfully. So first of all, we have to use here the tag and that is a toast container from the React Toastify. Let's go to the project of the user. And I'm going to copy this. Let me add inside the if block. And here I'm going to write the caption of the notification that is a notification sent successfully. Let me import the toast from the React Toastify. And here I'm going to add the else block where we have to show error toast with the caption failed to send a notification. And it will be a dot success. Now let's navigate to the browser. Let's fill the form like the title, five days, body we have, hello from body, and that same token. Let me get from here. Let's click on the send button. Let me check why it's not working. Let me open it the inspect. Let's go to the network tab. Okay, so we are getting here the error with the course. Let's go to the Node.js application. Let me open it the new terminal and here I'm going to write the command to install the course. As you can see, course installed successfully. Now I'm going to import the course. So we have to use the course inside the app.use. Now let's go back to the browser. Let's click on the send button again. We are getting a the status that we have 500. Let me check what is the issue. Okay, so we have to pass here the title body and the device token, not the XCM token. Let me update the variable name that we have device token. Let's go back to the browser. Let's click on the send button again. As you can see, we are getting in the notifications. So that's all for now from my side. If you have any confusion, you can document. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.